Here I will explain how you will be able to set the uh, double factor security for you to activate your login credentials at Universidad de la Sabana platforms. So you should first log in to uh, the URL provided for you to log in to the email. You will write there the login credentials sent in your email. Be sure that you write your user, including at unisavana.edu.co. After that, you will introduce the password that was also provided in the email to you. You should click then on sign in. There, you will be asked to uh, provide more information in order to get a security in your account. You should click on Next. There, Universidad de la Sabana will ask you for certain information in order for you to set the security information required. You should uh, take from the list, from both of the options, select mobile app. In this setting, you will use a mobile app for you to be able to set and activate your login credentials. After selecting mobile app, you will then select receive notification for verification. There are these two options. You will select the first one, receive notifications for verification. We will see how this will be set up. So at the same time, you should use your mobile phone in which you are going to download the app Microsoft Authenticator. Here on the screen, you can see how Microsoft Authenticator is seen or identified the icon that is identified with in, uh, in the apps. So you should download it. And as soon as you have it installed in your cell phone or mobile phone, you can open it. This is the way you find or identify the icon. As soon as you open it, you will click on Set or Configure Mobile App. Here, you should use the app that you have installed in your mobile for you to be able to scan the QR code that will be set here for you to be able to synchronize both the application with the institutional account. In your cell phone, you will click on these three little dots that are a, in the corner. And after that, you should click on Add Account. Then you should click on Work or a school account, since this is the account from uh, the university. After that, you should click on a scan a QR code. In that way, your camera is going to be activated for you to scan the QR code that you will see on the computer screen. There, you should see in the app after that, that Universidad de la Sabana's account will be there set. As soon as you do this process, then you will see how the setup has been configured. 
and codes are verified. You should then click on next. And there, in that moment, you will receive a notification or message on your mobile app device. You should click on approve. There, you are going to be able to select your country and a phone number in case that this information will be uh, required for you to be able also to log in as a second option of security. Your phone number is going to be private. After introducing the number, you should click on Next. And after that, the step four comes up, which is keep using your existing applications. So you should get started with this app by clicking on this icon on the screen for you to be able to copy the password and keep it. This password is a password that is going to be used as the password for you to start the session or to access to the platforms. As soon as you click on it, you can, and you copy the code, you can click on done. Then it, would, it will take you to the login phase there how should we contact you in that case you can use mobile app and here we will show you the second option for you to use the way and set the way to contact you by using the verification code. In this way, you should select verification code. Again, we will have opened the QR code there on the screen on the computer. There you go through the app in your device, in your mobile device, and you should click on add an account. Again, you should select work or school account and scan the QR code there with your cell phone. You will see how the account will be added. You will click on next. And there you can enter the verification code. So as soon as you clean up, click on the added account, you will open it and you will find a verification code there, which is the one that will be asked every time you open a virtual Savannah platform or Teams platform, you will have to enter this security code. After that, you can click on Verify. Again, you will select your country and introduce your mobile phone for security reasons and click on Next. You can copy then the password for you to get started with this app passwords and click on Done. Last but not least, you can keep your uh, password to be saved or to be um, uh, saved by your personal computer in the browser. So you can click there if you select yes or no, depending if the device you're using is your personal, you can use or click on yes so that your computer will remember the password, otherwise you should click on no and do the process every time 
uh, you log in. That's it. I hope this tutorial helps you out activate your credentials for Universidad de la Sabana.